Headline news for Thursday, February 10th from the Westchester County Business Journal, Fairfield County Business Journal, and westfaironline.com. Peter Katz reporting. Inflation continues unchecked, according to data released this morning by the U.S. Bureau of Labor Statistics. The inflation index covering all items rose 7.5 percent for the 12 months ending in January, the largest 12-month increase in 40 years since the period ending in 1982. The energy prices rose 27 percent over the last year, and the cost of food index increased 7 percent. Performer Snoop Dogg, whose real name is Calvin Broadus, has bought the record label Death Row, which in the past released his recordings. The purchase price was not disclosed. At its peak, Death Row Records was grossing $100 million a year. Purchase-based PepsiCo today released its 2021 financial report showing a 13% increase in revenues over the year 2020 and an 11% increase in the operating profit. PepsiCo took in $79.47 billion in 2021 compared with $70.37 billion in 2020. Its operating profit was $11.1 billion compared with $10.08 billion in 2020. The National Archives has asked the U.S. Justice Department to investigate defeated former President Donald Trump's handling of White House documents. The latest revelation was that the National Archives recovered several boxes of stolen White House documents, including classified material, from Trump's Florida estate, Mar-a-Lago. It previously had been disclosed that Trump destroyed documents during his term in office. Tesla is recalling more than 578,000 cars because a device designed to make noise so that pedestrians are aware that the rather quiet electric cars are approaching has not been operating the way it should. This Sunday, February 13th, will be the latest time of year that a Super Bowl has been played in its 56-year history. The Los Angeles Rams meet the Cincinnati Bengals in Los Angeles. Stay in touch with the Westchester County Business Journal, Fairfield County Business Journal, and westfaironline.com.